Out at the Sergeant Gary Morales Training Complex in St. Lucie County, dozens of young men and women are taking their turns at the range. And this is part of the 2023 Florida Sheriff's Explorers Association Conference. 300 participants from 23 law enforcement agencies throughout the state are here competing. This is the field that I want to enter. 19-year-old Brandon Lanier is a member of the Explorer Post with the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office. Where you can actually learn firsthand about uh, what law enforcement does on a day-to-day -day basis. I'm like, yes, I, this is definitely something that I want to do. Beyond improving their marksmanship, the explorers have been learning how to handle traffic stops. How to conduct them, what procedures, what statues that you need to know. Not only is this a competition, it also serves as a recruitment tool for agencies across the state. I was a good kid, but I was going down the wrong path, uh, to be honest. St. Lucie County Deputy Robert Doty says it was his involvement in the explorer program that kept him on the right path. Now he's a program advisor. It's awesome to watch these kids go and actually become successful. Detective Tanya Singley is also an Explorer alum. This SWAT team member has been with the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office eight years. Fell in love with law enforcement in general because of it. Uh, learning how to shoot a gun, learning real world scenarios. Explorer programs involve kids ages 14 to 21. And while not every participant here goes into law enforcement, for those who do choose this path, organizers say it provides valuable training and also builds bridges between young people and law enforcement. I want to make sure that I am the best law enforcement officer out there. It is honestly uh, so awesome to watch him uh, transition from this quiet, quaint little boy to a man now. The competition wraps up this weekend. In St. Lucie County, John Shane, the WPTV News Channel 5.